Good morning. U.S. core retail sales were unchanged last month, which was below market expectations. Besides, investors continued to monitor the spread of coronavirus in China. U.S. Dow fell on early last Friday. The Dow once fell 140 points. However, media reports saying that the White House is considering tax incentives for people in the U.S. to buy stocks. U.S. stock market recovered most of its early loss. U.S. stock markets closed mixed. The Nasdaq and S&P 500 index both rose 0.2% and hit new record high, while the Dow index fell 0.1%. Looking ahead this week, investor focus will eye on the Fed minutes to be released on Wednesday. Besides, Rubo will announce its PMI data on Friday, which will also be market focus. Forward looking, Exhubei newly confirmed cases continue to decline. Besides, China government launched a series of measures to maintain economic growth. Hong Kong stock market has been stabilized. However, as Hong Kong stock market has already accumulated significant rebound from its low, Hang Seng Index is likely to oscillate at the current level in near term. Hang Seng Index short term support is at 50 day moving average. And also, HSBC and PNR Insurance will announce final results this week. Corporate results will dominate the Hong Kong stock market in near term. For sectors, internet and CRO sector growth prospects remain promising, which will continue to be the market leaders. We suggest investors to buy during weakness. On the other hand, Mainland property sector also rebounded sharply due to anticipation of relaxation of control and monetary policies. However, as of Grande, lowered property project selling price to promote sales, which might hurt the sector sentiments in near term. Thank you.